five TV shows or movies like All of Us Are Dead. All of Us Are Dead was just simply a great show, so I thought I'd share the five best TV shows or movies that are most similar to the zombie apocalyptic phenomenon that hit Netflix. Here are five TV shows or movies like All of Us Are Dead. I'll keep this spoiler free. Number 5. Sweet Home Sweet Home is one of the more recent shows on this list to be released on a streaming platform. More specifically, you'll find this on Netflix. Released as recently as December 2020, the TV show made an impact on the platform. It's based on a webtoon of the same name, just like All of Us Are Dead was. Whilst not necessarily focused on zombies, this is more focused around an apocalyptic world that has monsters lurking around. It's set after a family tragedy occurs, which leads the main character, Hyun Su, to move out into a new apartment. It's here where he soon realizes that there are monsters outside trying to wipe out humanity. It's an apocalyptic horror drama and received good reviews all round. It contains 10 episodes and so far only has one season, so it's a good time to give it a binge. Number 4. Alive Alive is a South Korean zombie apocalyptic movie that was released on Netflix in 2020. The movie is focused around a video game streamer called Jun Woo, who is struggling to cope and fighting for survival on his own in his apartment block, whilst a zombie apocalypse is taking over Seoul. It's similar to All of Us Are Dead in the sense that there is this disease that's breaking out and causes infected people to want to hunt humans down and eat them. It's predominantly focusing around Jun Woo and his independent fight for survival. It's got a relatively short runtime of around an hour and 39 minutes, so it's one you can quite comfortably sit through. It also received fair reviews for the standard of movie that it is. Number 3. Kingdom Kingdom is slightly different to a lot of the shows on this list as it's set in the fictional past, quite far back in the past. It contains two seasons and is the highest rated recommendation on this list. Like All of Us Are Dead and Sweet Home, it's based off of a webtoon of the same name. The story focuses around an unnatural plague that is spreading around Korea and it's causing dead people to be resurrected. The show is focused around trying to prevent the plague from spreading and the leader's battle with trying to save the people of his kingdom from succumbing to the plague. There's two seasons of this show, so there's plenty to watch through. And you'll find this on Netflix. Number 2. Blood Red Sky Blood Red Sky is different to the others on this list, as it's not a zombie movie, but it's instead a vampire movie. It's a British-German thriller, horror, and action movie that sits at just over two hours for the runtime, the main synopsis is that a mysteriously ill woman has to unleash terror on a flight when a group of hijackers try to take over the plane on its overnight journey. When the movie released, it was watched by around 40 million viewers on Netflix, which ultimately made it the platform's most popular German release to date, so it's worth a watch. Number 1. Black Summer Black Summer is set just after an outbreak of a zombie apocalypse. It's a two-season show that was originally released in 2019, and its second season was released in 2021. Rose is the main character who has embarked on a mission six weeks after the apocalypse started, and she was separated from her daughter. The haunting journey that she goes on throughout the summer across the US is dark, deadly, and leads her to make decisions that have costly effects. The zombie's aim is to hunt the non-infected, and we see how Rose has to deal with this throughout her journey. This action horror show is definitely worth the watch. So, there you have it. The five TV shows or movies that are probably the next best thing to go to if you're craving something like All of Us Are Dead, and if you can't wait for season two. Will you be giving these a watch? Leave a comment down below, and don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you next time. <laughs>